Hello, everyone. We're back. We're back. Bye. You are listening to Famous This Podcast. I'm Alice. I'm back. Camden. Baby. Wayne. That's Wayne. And it's a new year. It's 2023. I feel like that's almost the first time I've said 2023 out loud. Yeah. 30 years ago was 1993. That How does that make you feel, oldie? Old. I was 12 in 1993. Yeah. Uh, Ninja Turtles. It was a good, good era. So it's been a while since our last podcast because holidays are mm-hmm. cray. Holidays um, are cray. We've had so much going on. Like, I love this time of the year, but I'm the last couple of weeks of December going through the new year are always insane for us. Mm-hmm. Especially this year. Well, this year, Cam finished up school. She's done with school, graduated. So she had that. You guys know we were talking about that a lot last time. And then it was Camden's birthday. How did your birthday end up going, Cam? It was good. Yeah. Um, a little existential because that's kind of crazy. Cam still is freaking out about it. Because it's crazy. It's not that crazy. Nothing's changed. Nothing's exploded. It's crazy. We're all doing good. It's crazy. <laughs> She's still freaking out. It's crazy. Just wait till you turn 40. <laughs> Things get weird. Yeah. Uh, graduate again. <laughs> Uh, we had Chris. We got together with my family, with my older sister's family, who also lives here in Vegas. Their family. She has four kids. They're very rambunctious and loud and fun. And we got together for Christmas Eve and Christmas. And I feel like I was exhausted for days after that. Anybody else feel the same way? You guys are both on your phone. Cam is on her phone. What are you doing? I'm editing a picture so I can post on my story. Absolutely not. Put your phone away. So I can post on my story. It takes a while to get back in the groove. Cam- yeah, Camden's already That's two minutes in. Part. Like, this isn't a good sign. She's already on her phone, not even listening to me. <laughs> I am I am listening. Talking about the chaos. Put it down. You're talking about the chaos. So it took a while to recover from this. Did you have a good Christmas? Yes. Still taking a while. It is taking a while. I hate January, Still, honestly. Like, uh, but yeah, it's know? known for being. You get lazy in the holidays. Yeah, well, your schedule's so different, and it's changed so much. You can only you have to do these things. You get up and you go, and it's not like you have to and you don't want to, but like, it's definitely a different pace than what we're used to here. We're kind of homebodies, and we do each one of us do our own thing, and then we yeah. congregate for an hour, and we then congregate, and then we do our own things, you know. Yeah. Um, and that's just how we are. Everything works. We're a happy family. Mm-hmm. But like then the holidays, and of course we want to see our families. But man, it tires me out. Yeah, it messes with me. Did you eat some good Christmas goodies? Did you have some good Christmas gifts? Yeah. Well, speaking of goodies and gifts, the one gift I got was the relish I love. And I made the dip myself this year. <laughs> you did. He got... Um, Which one? It's from Harry and David, the onion relish. relish and onion. And, and you mix it with cream cheese. Yeah. And use it for chips. Oh, that one. The you, orange you one? You ate a lot of it. The orange one? When, the sweet one? Yeah. When Wayne used to work at a mall that was right... His area where he managed was right near a Harry and David... Yeah, And so when Cam was little and before Wayne was closing up, we'd go walk at the free samples of Harry and David of the dip. They served it with tortilla chips. the first time delicious. I tried it. And I was like, I'm hooked. He was hooked. I'm hooked too. It's delicious. It really and you fun. came home and I swear you made it that same night. You got it in your stocking. You made it. It was gone before. Yeah. Before the new year for sure. Um, it lasted a few days. Christmas was good. And as always, the cookies. Yeah, we have a lot of traditional foods. We Traditional for us foods we had around the holidays. And we didn't have them all because I didn't throw the Christmas Eve party this year. But we had all the Christmas cookies. <gasps> we had the punch. We didn't have sesame. The sandwiches. cookies, the dips. We didn't have the meatballs. We, we didn't, didn't have, have the ham, meatballs. No, the ham oh, the ham. <laughs> There's stuff we didn't have. 
I didn't even think That's about that. That's all I think about that. <laughs> we didn't have the meatballs. And we didn't have the No, we didn't have plate. the sandwiches. And we didn't have the sandwiches. And we didn't have the little smokies either. So. <laughs> and we didn't have the little don't smokies. Think, don't talk about it. Don't talk about it. Right, we, we're going to have a day later that's going to be We like had really, really good Christmas. food. Um, <laughs> our brother-in-law had got a smoker for his birthday, like a legit smoker. And he smoked brisket and pork, right? That was Christmas Eve, but it was delicious. As good as I've ever had at any barbecue place. That was one of the, yeah. So props to them. All the food was delicious. My mom and my sister and everyone else. It felt like I was kind of let off the hook this year because I, everyone knew, everyone in my family knew that I was kind of not feeling it this year. It was hard for me to get going and get motivated and just work through like a whatever. It's weird. Usually like on Christmas, we just eat snacks. Chips and those hot dog things, and it's like yeah. I need something. Because you're eating all day, but you're not hungry. You know what I mean? It's not. Wayne is such a belly. whiner. He is like the pickiest whiny boy. I had boy. two pieces of pizza. I need dinner. He yeah. does. He like needs like a dinner that has a thing, a this, and like a bread. You know what I mean? He yeah. has to be very traditional. <laughs> Give me like a school lunch. He needs his uh yeah. Plates. I need to get him one of those plates. We'll yeah, take, with, yeah, yeah, with the little uh, yeah perfectly portioned areas. I'm gonna get you one of those, babe. Perfect. Yeah. My grandma oh, my. had those growing up, and I loved those <laughs> plates. Yeah, I want one of those. Probably had lots of VOCs or prison on tray. those. Yeah, prison tray. Perfect. For prison your own tray. personal prison. Well, I guess it could be a school of tray. 18 years. <laughs> um, a tray. We, anyways, we had a great Christmas. Mm-hmm. We took a few days to recover from Christmas, Camden's birthday, mm-hmm. Christmas Eve, all that stuff. Uh, we partied on New Year's, theoretically, kind of. I partied on East Coast time in my Animal Crossing town. What? So that would have been 9 p.m. Oh, in the Animal Crossing. <laughs> and we had our older nieces Not real here. Life. They hung out with Camden. Yeah. They partied, played video games, had fun. Mm-hmm. Lots of Genshin. And so then, it's the new year. That's what's going on here. We had some great live streams. We've yes. been going to the live streams. We had some great patron live streams. Yeah. So everything's been going except for the podcast. We just haven't had the time to fit it in and do it and have the energy and all that stuff. <gasps> you guys. But we are back. Ready to hear my weekly shopping addiction? No, oh, no. Camden's obsession. What's your obsession now? <laughs> well, Please tell me it's something that costs one dollar a piece. On, there's two. And they're both really expensive. Not but. cheap things. How come you never get obsessed with cheap stuff? <laughs> I have. Okay, what do you got? I have. I've gone addicted Camden to mobile games. Camden got, as part of her birthday and Christmas or whatever, she got gift cards to places and stuff like that. So she's been spending her money. So what are your obsessions currently? So I... Keyboard... Stuff okay. Cam did talk about keyboard Which forever. Really so Cam has a razor keyboard expensive. she's had. But I, I've realized a smart way to make it not expensive. I ordered very cute keycaps on Etsy, and they're little bears and they're rainbow, rainbow bears. You saw them, mom. They're really cute. I and adorable. I knew a very expensive obsession I'm going to have is Nandroids. Well, I've always said Cam always has loved Nendroids. She's has a Nen- she got a curb a couple Kirby Nendroids for her thinking, birthday one year. They don't just have they don't have to have a place to go. They can I can just be you know, one day Hatsune Miku can be by my computer. Yeah. Or in my PC or playing Cam got a Nan- Nendroid in her stocking and so now that renewed her yeah, interest was, in Nendroids. Yes. Well I asked for it. Oh. Yeah. And it was very cute. It's the... It's very cute. It's, it's very cute. The Lucky Cat um, version of Hatsune Miku. It's so cute. So Camden's had her little obsessions. Of course we all have our obsessions, now, right? What I did is Nendroid wouldn't have been that expensive, okay? But then I discovered they have Nendroid dolls, which are, like, articulated. They can, like, move and stuff. So I bought a body for that. So more. a body that fits on a the body regular that fits on the head. Okay. And I bought, I have to buy clothes for that separate body. This is where you learn how to knit and sew and you just make your little clothes yourself. <gasps> there you go. Go for it. <laughs> Wayne, what is your I current obsessions? I mean, what, I've always been obsessed with movies. Oh. Wayne is <laughs> oh. Why not? I mean, so what movie lately? 
Who what movies just, just have movies. you bought That's or all. searched out or found lately? Just things that I, I like grow up to, you know, oh. 90s action movies. I was just saying Horror. currently, you know, if there's something that just popped up recently deck. that you're very into. I'm obsessed with Hitman again. Oh, that's right. Your Steam Deck. Thanks a lot. That's yeah. what you're obsessed yeah. with. That's my for true obsession. That is the recent obsession. We're talking about kind of recent obsessions. Thanks a lot. Now I get he, nothing done again. Santa, which is my mom, got him a Steam Deck. <laughs> Santa, which is Santa like mom. my mom is Santa. I believe mm-hmm. in Santa. That's my mom. <laughs> yep, everybody. When, there's your proof. <laughs> Santa uh, got me the DeLorean. Oh, the Santa. I wrote Santa or on something. it. Something. But you, my mom got me the Steam Deck. Wayne threatened me a few days before Christmas. If I don't have a present under the tree with Santa on it from Santa, I'm like leaving basically. Yeah, yeah. And I so the not. present I got him yeah, and then became did. from Santa. You funny. need something from Santa. You're right. If I don't get a present from Santa, Christmas is dead or something. Yeah, Why pretty are, much. Are you getting presents from Santa or just me? Just no, you. Don't. Cameron not getting oh. Santa presents. I didn't write Santa on any of her presents. <laughs> Only on your present. You didn't write Santa. Santa wrote Santa. Oh, I mean, um... Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, crap. <laughs> what are okay. you talking about? Oh, I no. Mean, you are the only one good cut enough the, in this family cut. to get a present from Santa, babe. Yay. How does that feel? <laughs> Yay. Oh, y'all got coal. Well, we just oh, didn't get right. anything. Like, it's even like the no care where they don't even give you anything. Cole's kind of cool. I mean, well, people are clinging on to their coal. Well, it's not cool. Give me like a little uranium. The coal color. industry isn't cool. I was bad for Christmas, so I got a hip hop album. It was J. Cole. <laughs> I like J. Cole. Paula Cole. I don't know. I just what made that What other Coles? Up. <laughs> On the spot. Um, what? Yeah. Yeah, he's good. He's yeah. good. I just, I mean, who else is a rather rapper that has coal in their name? I don't know these things. Exactly. Wait, you came up with that? Yes. That's pretty good. I just wrote it in oh, my head. Oh, Cameron's right got now a slight the podcast. appreciation for Wayne. <laughs> like, Mark this minute. day on your calendar. We'll be celebrating it every year from now on. Oh, my the God. January 8th. Camden said, oh, that's not bad. <laughs> I, I should say have that on the joke it. sometimes. I should have saved it for a real Hey Cam video. It's funny. I didn't know you knew who J. Cole was. I don't know who J. Cole is, if that means anything. I don't know any of That's songs. great, Mom. Thanks for telling <laughs> us. <laughs> I have no new obsessions. Usually it's the opposite. It's, it's like, my cat. If it means obsession. anything, I care about what you're talking about. And you're like, if it means anything, I don't care and don't know. So. <laughs> exactly. Literally Cute don't cats. care. I'm just here. Are you kidding me? You're obsessed with tennis. I am obsessed with tennis. Okay. One of our things this year... Well, and we've talked about it for probably two years on this podcast, how we want to start playing tennis. And finally, I got you guys to come out and play tennis with me. Woohoo! Yeah, I've gone every day except for today. Today I slept till 11 and it was amazing. I have gone every days. day. It's kind of like I've been part of every single podcast. Hmm, who else can say that? No one else. Uh, just me. Well, I didn't even know I was going to be doing the podcast. You go by yourself and just like Remember? hit the fence. I was like, there's no way I can play by you myself. You guys are doing a podcast. I can't do a podcast. So anymore. my goal is to make it so get Wayne or Camden to the point where they're good enough where we can play a legit match, where we can go play all the time. That's your goal? Yeah. To actually have a tennis match? Let's play. That's I what thought you, I was just to sit around and like That's what you exercise. eventually do. You just play What's like a fun little match. What's wrong with having a tennis match? Well, that's why you're getting me on my form. I'm trying. She said that before. So you guys need to get good so we can actually play. Yeah, I'm, I'm like, like get good, bro. We got pickleball. <laughs> yes, yeah. and also get Santa pickleball. was listening when I was talking about pickleball because I also want to learn how to Let's play, play pickleball. ball and eat pickles. So we're gonna alternate between pickleball. So how does pickle? Where do we play pickleball? Pickleball, we have to go to a different park for. Oh, there's a pickleball park. Yeah, a pickleball. Pickleball, park. I think, is more my speed. See, I can't let introduce you to pickleball yet because life. you'll stop playing tennis, and I really want to keep playing tennis too. Pickleball and uh, what's the I one like tennis like in England? They hit the thing. Cricket. Like, cricket. Cricket's up my speed. What's croquet? Croquet, croquet. is with a mallet on the ground. That's similar, right? What's cricket? Croquet and cricket. Cricket is like baseball in the India and UK. No, no, not cricket. Well, croquet. I don't really That's know baseball. The one in Alice in Wonderland. Oh, croquet. That's not even they, a racket sport. Where they, where they hit the thing and it goes through the little... Wickets. Thing. Yeah, that. The uh, Alice in Wonderland sport. We would have to go to a park with um, some grass to play it, but we could. Horseshoes. We could play croquet. 
I would like you guys to get good at tennis. First. I used to get That's down with some horseshoes. You being your arm is so tired I've said, after too many hours. Camden of is learning. Camden is trying. I go, Camden, form. And she's realizing now you get a lot less sore if you're using proper form, a lot less mm-hmm. tired. You mm-hmm. know, your wrist doesn't hurt. You have better shots. Lane's I try to like, learn the proper form. Dad doesn't like the proper form. Dad doesn't like the proper form. I can't form. figure it out, the whole form thing. Watch a video. I just it's, hit the ball. The thing about tennis is I've been playing tennis. I got tennis basically for my birthday. Tennis lessons from my grandparents for my birthday or whatever. From, I don't know, when I was five until when I was in high school. And I played tennis in high school. So I've been playing tennis a long time. I haven't played for 20 years. But like I told Wayne, tennis comes right back to you. But you remember it. It's like Yeah, it's like like muscle memory. It's amazing what muscle memory can do. Mom is good. Mom is good at everything. Yeah. Except I found out I'm not good at something. <gasps> and freaking was terrifying. <laughs> Do you guys know what I'm talking about? Uh, singing. Yeah, I'm not good at singing. Well, oh, it's not singing I was singing, <laughs> but I am not good at singing. <laughs> impressions. Impersonations. Oh I am terrible. I'm notoriously terrible at impressions. I think you're really oh. good at them. I think that you like if it was Jimmy, no, Fa- Jimmy Fallon and you did like the impression game. There's with a him, difference you know, between be, why lie and dead obvious world. lying. Brute. That'd be the best He's thing. He's trying in the to embarrass world. me. It's like when you want your kid to sing a Christmas song and they like keep messing up the words and their list comes out and they, you know, just are so cute. You know what I mean? I'm cute doing them badly. You have to listen to the people before you impress, do the impression. And you haven't heard them in a while, so it's different, you know. If you guys were on our uh, live stream the other night, I was doing impressions and I was legitimately trying and I was terrible. So I found the thing that I'm just not good at. It was hilarious. I have very poor control of like it was very my funny. head muscles. Yeah. I can't clip. raise an eyebrow either. So you found out that you're actually there. really funny. Oh you're no. I found out I'm actually funny. I mean, you're funnier than I am. We all know that. But you know what I mean? Like you're a comedian. Oh. Fake impressions. Go on stage and do <laughs> Fake that. Fake impressions. You'll kill it. At some point, people are going to be like, um, this is so annoying. Uh, but yeah, that was a good good live stream. I but I found out something I'm not good at. Wow. Shockingness. It is shocking. And singing. But after 20 years, and singing. Oh, sorry. I'm not Great singing. singing. When I can hear, I'm Though, really people at on people on the live stream, they go, oh, wow, I loved hearing Alice sing. They loved hearing it. They didn't love it. <laughs> <laughs> they didn't. They loved hearing it. They didn't think it was good. Yeah, they, they just said they it's loved like, hearing uh, it. It's like William Hung. Isn't he the, wasn't he the one that was terrible on American Idol, but everyone loved him? There were people who watched Fred. Yeah. What was his right. name? The one they kept voting for just because they William were, Hung. It was fun. Oh, I like that. That was, that was so funny, though. That poor guy got famous for all the wrong funny. reasons. I mean, but he ta- he look at you, it. babe. Exactly. You're not funny. I, nobody watches the videos for me. Okay. We all know Everyone that. loves Wayne. We He's all America's know that. dad. Ben Rowley loves Wayne. American Dad. Ben <laughs> Rowley is my super fan. And I love you, Ben. I love Ben also. Love I love ben. you more, Ben. And Andy and everybody and Andy. else. You guys are awesome. Andy, our patrons. Didn't I love Andy our carry uh, I'm a dad? Andy was. I'm a dad. I'm a dad. Except our patrons are getting a little annoyed because they're trying to hold us accountable. They're like, wait, when is this thing you said you were going to do? When is this going to happen? Hey. We that play. sounds like Up Dad. No. That sounds like <laughs> no. Up Dad. What, you want us to say what's up, Dad? Yeah, what, uh, what's up, Damn Dad? you both! <laughs> what's up, Dad? Ha! Uh, <laughs> <laughs> that totally was a joke. Didn't... I thought you were going to have something funny afterwards. You ruined it. Were you going to say something? What's up, Dad? No, that's it. Oh. The sky. That's it. What's no, up, you're Dad? supposed to say nothing much. What's up with you? Yeah, exactly. Yeah, You exactly. literally messed up your own joke. You were... <laughs> botched. Go on that show that's called Botched. <laughs> Um, <laughs> go on that show that's called I Shouldn't Be Alive. You're just like, huh? I wanted to go on that circle, but I guess I should go on square, because I'm a square. That's right. The double L loser. What in the, what's you a are a square. I've started the new season of The Circle. If anyone's watching that, you guys can uh, weigh in on Wayne's Instagram. And tell Is it think. good? I don't know. I like the original circle. I feel like people are much more conniving now. It's changed so much. But I still like it. It's still fine. It's good, and I'm glad Chubama's back, because I like him. But... Uh, so, on January 2nd of this year, we ate canes. 
We did? We did. Oh, yeah. That was a week ago, correct? I didn't eat enough of it. You didn't I eat it enough? I should crazy. But we decided, so I, <clears throat> online people do meet meatless January. Try not to eat meat in January. And you've heard Wayne talk about a lot where he's going pescatarian. He says it a lot. I haven't had too much fish for a pescatarian. I, we've done it one week. But I'm saying we've been doing the old <laughs> vegetarian no like, meat I'm done. meals. I can't do it anymore. For one week. And Wayne's actually acting tortured. But how would you say it's been? I'm I, I'm telling you, I was not joking when I said I don't care about meat. Camden has I'm been loving it. it. Camden has been I've very been complimentary. She's saying this is so good. It is good. This is amazing. It's really we're, not, good. we're not making that up. Like the the meals are delicious. You are killing it I'm in killing the kitchen. It. I'm following recipes the way like a dad trend. compliments. He's like, wow, this is like actually. F- <laughs> yeah, you made like a, a, a freaking Panda Express tofu today, and it was amazing. And this is for me. I don't. I've never been a tofu person. I don't like tofu. The one time I had tofu, I guess I was just grossed out by it. And like thinking about certain things and textures of food grossed me out. But like I made it, and I go, okay, I'm gonna eat this, and I ate it. It was good. Yeah, and people on my story have seen your lunches. Oh. I've been posting them. <laughs> well, then. So, they, they We'll know. see how long Wayne puts up with it. I like it. I also like it. I, I mean, I feel good. I feel better. It's weird. We're feeling pretty good. And the thing about Las Vegas, vegetables are cheap as frick here. Yeah. We can get a week's, two weeks worth of vegetables for, like, less than $10. Like, a gigantic amount of vegetables. So, like... If you know where to shop. I thought it'd be the opposite. Yeah, you think, that's why a lot of times you think, okay, I've got to go to Whole Foods to buy these things. No, you go, if you're in Las Vegas, you go a lot of Bonita, the Mexican grocery store, and uh, you can yeah. get pounds and pounds yeah. of vegetables for so cheap. Store. It's insane. You can get five avocados for a dollar. Crazy. Whoa. Yeah. Five? I know, right? Five of those tiny little avocados. One thing we haven't been able to get lately, like, anywhere, and, like, we can't afford to eat anymore, is eggs. Is it, like, a, a country-wide I'm fine. Thing? But the egg or stuff or the vegetables? Yeah, we can't get eggs. Eggs are, like, I looked today, it was 18, I used to get an 18 uh, count of eggs for, what, $1.99? Yeah, $2.99? we would buy them on sale at $1.89, $2.29. Like, we always shop the sales. For 18. Yeah, I know. And I couldn't find them anywhere less than nine ninety nine. Yeah. $10. Fine without eggs, too. Eggs aren't vegan, are they? Well, no. But so I guess, really, we are eating almost. cheap. We are eating the dried beans and the beans from the Mexican grocery store and the vegetables. So we are eating cheap, cheap? guys. We are eating cheap. We're eating good. Our coffee and our Diet Pepsi is probably the most expensive thing in the house. Yummy. Um, yeah, so things are going good here anyways. I'm really... So I'm if really we don't talk about Cane's... We decided to go vegan because Cane's never sponsored us. And yeah, we're angry. Kane's. It's all yeah, raising of you. Cane's fault. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Who went vegan? Well, vegetarian for at least a month. What do you mean? I'm. We're much, doing good. Am I, ve- I mean, currently oh, we're doing pretty good. What have I had that's not? So we've been trying to get into good habits. Really, that's what we've been trying yeah. to do. January is notoriously bad for our family. Not like bad, like, oh, whatever. But like, we have a terrible time getting a start to the year after the holidays, you know, because you're in a kind of a depression in January already because all the fun is over. All the buildup is over. Mm -hmm. You know, usually Cam's going back to school and Wayne's starting back up work and all this other stuff. This is when people go back to work. Yeah. And they go back to school. And the weather sucks. that's when they get all in. And like... You're trying to, you know, clean up after the holidays and all this other stuff. And it's very hard to get into new habits. It's even worse almost because I'm like, I'm not doing anything with my life. And I've always been like a humongous proponent of like having a schedule and sticking to it. And you guys know this last year I was struggling with a lot of stuff. And one of the things that really faltered was my schedule. And that's why I wasn't as productive and I don't think I was as happy. So I'm really, really sticking to a schedule and I'm kind of trying to add in a new task that I want to make sure I do every week. And so the first week of January, I was like, okay, I am playing tennis every day. And then I'm going to add in something new this next week. So there we go. I'm going to start learning how to drive and go for walks and things like this. So adding in a task and sticking to, you know, a good habit we're doing it. Is what we're planning on doing. We kind of asked people, like, what good habits are you wanting to adopt? Because we failed. Let's be honest here. We failed, or I failed, miserably on my New Year's resolutions from last year. 
I thought 2022 was going to be my year. I really thought it in my brain. I thought it to be true. I truly believed it for a hot minute. 2023? Everyone did. 2022. 2022 is probably one of the worst years I've had in a a very long time. So I didn't read all the books I said I was going to read. Spoiler alert, I've already read a book this year. I didn't go on hikes. We didn't go camping. Um, We didn't play tennis last year. Uh, There was a lot of things that I didn't do that I said I wanted to do last year. Lots of things came They're going to be this year. This year I'm determined... I'm going to be happy. I'm going to get my stuff done. Woohoo! What good habits are you trying to adopt, Cam? Yay. I want to drive. Well, I want to go on a walk every day. Go on a walk every day. That's an excellent habit to have, like, for the rest of your life. Yeah. And tennis. Yeah. Tennis, I'm going to actually, I'm going to do. Every Cam's going to get good. Cam and I are going to be good. And then we're yeah. going to get, like, a membership to the tennis club that's near us. Cam and I are going to show up to the tennis club. Yeah, the tennis club. Yeah, that's right. That's right. Watch out, tennis club. Watch out, tennis club. Cam and I are strolling up to exactly. that tennis club. <laughs> Watch out, tennis club. We're going to play tennis. <laughs> Watch out. That's right. We are. We are. We're going to do it well. <laughs> we are going to play tennis, and it might be mediocre. It might be okay. Okay, so yes. That's a good goal. And I'm not talking about just, I, there are some me, little habits I need to do that I need to start doing. I used to have, I used to be really good about it. If something needs to be done, I'd be like, okay, I might as well do it now instead of later. That was my thing. Remember? Yeah. And I was doing so good at it. Depression. Depression hits you like a freaking bus. But even things like closing the cupboard doors when I'm done, getting something out, mm-hmm. things like this are things I need to work on. Like it's basic and I'm sorry. If someone feels whatever, like, oh my god, you're crazy, lady. You can't close a cupboard. But sometimes I just mentally can't well, close yeah, a damn cupboard. Cu- yeah. It's too freaking hard. Does someone that just can't, like, go to my... I can't play Genshin. Like, I'm- like I just can't. I, and it, it sucks. I'm trying to work on these things. So what are the habits also that people said they wanted to have this year? Did we ask the question? Well, how did we word this question? I'm I remember. in the first two, which is eating better and getting up earlier. Yeah. For the most part. Um, and I, I have a, it's kind of an interesting, I don't want to say habit, but resolution is to keep the car clean on the outside. So I'm going to wash the car. <laughs> we haven't washed our car in so long. <laughs> Since we've purchased it, basically. Yeah. And then after the car is washed inside and out, it looks amazing like it did when we first got it. We're going to keep it that way. Oh, what a good plan. And Camden has a little Ooh. Kirby decal for the every window. <gasps> there you go. See? You can put it on there. My Kirby decal. So every couple of weeks. Um, and then Cam can finish her, you know, getting her Excellent. license. Excellent, yeah. And we can uh, hook up the windows. Yeah, we're going to get the windows tinted before summer because yeah. this is our first car we've had in Vegas that I, I don't think it originally came from Vegas. It's a used car yeah. and the windows aren't tinted. And this summer was scorching. <laughs> the last summer we had it. In the summer here, it's almost like you have to have your yeah, windows tinted. Yeah, you have to have some tinted windows. We're pricing out some big difference. tinting. And Wayne is getting up earlier, and it's a huge accomplishment. So I only have... It's, like, very weird for me in the mornings before I would wake up in the mornings, and I have, like, four hours to myself. Yeah. And now I only have, like, an hour and a half, and it's, like, weird. It's, it's I, a I, weird I, adjustment. I slept in today, and it was, like, a mess with me. It was weird. Like, so I, I try to tell Camden, off. I'm like, no matter yeah, what, whether you stay up till 3 or you stay up till 10, you got to get up at the same time every day. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You're just a little more tired the next day, and then you still Well, that's the weird thing. When I, had my, when I was doing the business, sometimes I would go to bed at 10, sometimes I would go to bed at 3 in the morning, but I would always wake up at like yeah. 9 or 8 to get ready and do the show, you know? And you have to do it every day, and weekends You can do included. it. Old people stuff. <laughs> um, what you guys got for these questions? What did we ask these people, Cam? So... What's a good habit you wish you had? What's a good habit that makes your day easier? Waking up earlier. Ayo, who said we that? We just said that. Daniela Baker. Daniela. Daniela, we're there sleeping. with you. I, I, I guarantee you, I, I like love watching the sunrises. I love seeing the sunrise. I haven't seen the sunrise since I was 11 years old. That's, <laughs> that can't be true. <laughs> I swear I have not. 
Except for like maybe no. if I was in the late night drive or something and it was coming up and I was like, wow, you know, this an, is an when, airplane. like on January, whatever, when we were going to go play tennis, let's do it. Let's go early. Let's go at like six. I'm like, babe, it's dark at six. <laughs> like, you don't understand. It's like still dark outside. We can't go. <laughs> exactly. Like, I don't know. <laughs> All good in the I think it's hood. nice at that time. It's super nice. My eat a healthy time. breakfast. Ah. Which, uh, I don't eat breakfast in general, so one of my goals is to actually eat breakfast. Do you Even want to eat breakfast? Does it make you feel better? Meat. Does eating breakfast make you it feel could. better? It could. It could. It could. I don't know if it will. I don't eat breakfast. Breakfast Camden. is BS. Not Camden doesn't eat breakfast, breakfast, breakfast either. Drink coffee. <laughs> that's my I drink, lunch. I drink coffee. I eat like one giant I'll meal. I'll throw up if I eat breakfast. That's, that's how my body works for some yeah. reason. I'm always... not hungry when I wake up. It doesn't matter if I wake up at 6 in the morning, if I wake up at 3 in the afternoon. I'm not hungry. That means you don't have to eat breakfast unless you think it would make you feel better. Okay, maybe not then. Well, because I, breakfast I is like BS a, and the... A banana. Yeah. Or something. Small. Like before playing tennis or whatever. Coffee and a banana. Breakfast protein, is a we can do societal beans. construct. <laughs> yes. Peanut breakfast. Butter, protein, We've been shake. told our whole life we're supposed to have breakfast, the most important meal of the day. We're supposed to have 12 freaking servings of bread a day. Can um, you imagine if you pieces of bread a day? What? Who says that? I swear that? that's what the food pyramid was when we were that growing is up. Like not six very... to twelve servings of grain a day. That is not very keto. That is not very. That's yeah. definitely not keto. And we're not doing keto. But you need your fiber. <laughs> well, grain, not... grain is still part of that. Where you like, okay, you eat a pasta, and you have to have a piece of bread on the side. <laughs> He's like, yeah. Um, <laughs> issues? What's what's going on? <sighs> I don't care what people eat. Honestly, what makes you happy? I mean, I would. I'd be like. Look, I haven't had breakfast, and I'm kind of fine, maybe. Maybe if I ate breakfast, my problems would go. I, I just drink too much coffee. It's I my breakfast. breakfast. Like Camden is the person that's like, I'm, yeah, we used to have breakfast. And I love making breakfast food. I love, I that's one of my jobs. I like, you know, do you have, though. like, jobs in bad. the back of your head that you think you could do? I could be a diner breakfast maker. I get nauseous. But I like it. breakfast it looks so good, and then I, like, try to force myself to. Brenner. Yeah, I know. That's what, Camden, early on, even in elementary school, eating breakfast, she never felt very good eating breakfast, so she it's doesn't eat breakfast. There's two kinds of people that eat breakfast. You have the, like, my mom, which is the eggs and the bacon and the everything, pancakes, that's just too much for eight in the morning. Or the Danish. And the cup of coffee. That's me. That's can basically that. candy bar for breakfast. I can do the candy bar for breakfast. Sometimes I can't simple. even have a small thing. The I'll eat the small. I'll take but an I can hour. See wanting to get your day started and on the I'm right thing. Coffee cake. They're saying eat a healthy breakfast is what their their habit they want to pick up is. Yeah. You know, they so do. they're probably saying I don't want to just get up and grab a donut with my coffee. I want to actually have you know some oatmeal or eggs or donuts. Genius. <laughs> Yeah, genius. yeah, say like a glazed donut and a cup of coffee. There's really nothing better. At that this time. is not the point of what these people are saying. Yeah, I I agree. Sweet with coffee is delicious. Though I hate donuts. It's amazing. I would never ever do this in a million years. P. A. Rams fam says in the shower, cold for thirty seconds. More if you can take it. Only we were just seconds? talking about what what a baby Wayne is. I'm Wayne is literally the biggest shower. baby in the world. It was nice. That mm-hmm. stuff, I felt like a, so. I was reborn. I felt like a it butterfly. It feels, honestly, it does. It am I missing like, something? It does. It's like, like with this whole ice bath crap. Like, am I missing something? Does that do something? Yes, you yes, are missing something. you. It's a, and something about your immune system or something. It's supposed to be good for your skin. It's supposed to be no, good for your it hair. it really just feels good. Like, it wakes you up. It makes you feel productive. It doesn't... <laughs> Wayne, Wayne's like, no. <laughs> yeah, we we like heard him torture. T- the shower goes cold for five seconds, Wayne, like. <laughs> screams bloody yeah, murder exactly because warm showers are kind of like pretty bad I like they like it made me sleepy i used to hate it when you take the stupid showers before you jumped in the cold pool it's just kind of a similar feeling like when you go out for a walk at like six in the morning and it's cold and you get the brisk air in your face or you're playing tennis and it's cold when we first mm-hmm. start it does help kind of invigorate you a little bit. Yeah, I was burning hot at the end. I've done today. the cold shower, especially during the summer, and it feels really Kim doesn't bad. have that cold bone. Nice. It's weird. That cold. You could, I you get could cold. sit in an ice I just, bath I just like, like those people cold. do in Russia or whatever. You know, you see the those videos on TikTok well, have have where they literally like just break the ice and go into the lake. Even if you can't. Even if you theoretically and they're just couldn't like detect the cold. eating a popsicle <laughs> in the frozen lake. And I'm just like, <laughs> you need training cold. and you need like, not yeah. training, but 
There's technique acclimation to ice cold. Get yourself to acclimated to it. Yeah, cold shower. I think just, that's a. F- I mean, I think that's dangerous. a habit. I could try doing that. If year. you're just in like Alaska and you see a a hole in the ground, and you're like, yeah, let's go. No, you <laughs> will. You will. You might paralyze yourself and I'm drown. I'm pretty sure that you've been <laughs> killing it at this. And that Snickerdoodle two eight nine says folding my laundry every day. Oh, Snickerdoodle. That's a good habit. I'm good at folding the laundry. I don't even know where my clothes are. Putting away the laundry is an issue, though. Wait, oh, my God. I'm so bad. I we hate, have nowhere I hate to laundry. put it. I hate laundry. Yeah. But, yeah. Staying on top of laundry is an excellent habit. Doing laundry that is we're, the first step. We, we used to be good at. We're going to get back at it. I like this one. Fat Toaster 6. I like that name. Brave little toaster. Have you Exercise ever seen that at all, let alone consistently. Good for you. Mm-hmm. Anything is good. Walking a little bit. Wayne was reading that, like, even just like a short. What were you reading? Like a short burst of like physical, like carrying heavy groceries or something for Anything. a little bit of time. Any, any even for like less than five activity. minutes, it's like a huge boost. Adds another couple of days to your life. Just literally. Wow, if I lift groceries two days. Okay, just so going every to get the day. Groceries read from this. Amazon and bring it back in. I just added a day of my life. Damn, Dad, I'm living the forever. To get the Amazon groceries Dad and read in the this kitchen. on some website called like betterlife.com. Yeah. Maybe it's an hour. And but it, you know and what it I mean. probably yeah, promoted like a, some granola bar or something. The point or is, one of those, like, I'm life living forever if you're in groceries and uh, like this tennis is going to help. <laughs> oh, absolutely, definitely. Even if we're not like great yet, we're still getting tired, <laughs> and we're still oh, yeah, like yeah. tired at the end of it. But not even if we're tired. not constantly moving, like I think, wow, we used to play like two hour long matches back in the day. Holy crap! Then I don't know if I can do this one for, with you. Saving money, budgeting. Oh my god, excellent! Who's this? Finnegan. Finnegan, good idea. We're trying to do well personally <laughs> for myself. This is not Camden. No buying buy nothing January. Is that what it's Too called? I failed. Where I'm not buying anything that's beyond like food, something we need for like fixing a house. You know what I mean? Like fixing something like we need right away. Or that's it. Mm-hmm. I'm not buying a luxury whatever, toy or I need to plant or anything more... like that. Not necessarily frugal, but just like, yeah, not just spending yeah. money on Just at least stuff. for this month, just not buying anything stupid. Forever. I yeah. could make mine, at least for now, thinking more about my purchases, at least. Yeah. Because, like, there are some things I'll be like, yeah, that makes me happy, and it's comforting, and it's cute. And then there are some things that I see, and I'm like, why, why did I buy that? Like, yeah. it was like, add this to your cart? I'm like, yeah, add this to your cart? Yeah, for sure. Do it, Etsy. Etsy's dangerous, guys. Don't get Etsy. <laughs> Don't get Etsy. I'm sorry, Etsy. You can't sponsor us. I can't take it. <laughs> I love shopping on Etsy, though. It's great. <laughs> but it's, that's what makes it so bad. Because they tailor it exactly no, to you. No, Someone has perfectly. made the exact thing I don't you get want it. on Etsy. Because Amazon is like, the recommendation is like, okay, yeah, every once in a while. Etsy, every single time I open it, I'm like, oh my god. It has everything of everyone in the world, and I need all of it. <laughs> You don't realize the difference between, like, especially with when I was in the real world, quotations, compared to, like, being here eating lunch every day. You know, oh, out, say, yeah. The real world, outside in the real world. I was working conventions, and it cost $14 for a sandwich and a soda. You yeah. know what I mean? And, like, it was the same this amount of money. So, like, for the amount you were eating, we'll feed all of us for lunch, you know, exactly. while, while we're here. That's just crazy. You get lucky if I could find a hot dog or something for yeah. $3. Mm. So. That is an excellent habit, and I'm going to work on that this year. Yes. Exactly. Because there are things I want to do. Camden also wants things to do. She wants to save money to travel and do other things. So that's a good habit. Yeah, well, I'm saving a, good a habit specific tab. amount of money. Ben Rowley. Ben! 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 Ben came to his first live stream last, his first trivia night live stream. Last week, and he heard the impressions. Hope you enjoyed it. Yeah, that was it. a really good first live stream to come to. For, no, it's for terrible. Trivia. It's horrible. I think because it was none of them the will be funny. I know, and so now they'll just be like, "This sucks." This is like, <laughs> no, it was funny. Can't so Ben Rowley says, and I think this is amazing. And I actually used to drink energy drinks. Stop drinking energy drinks. Oh, it took you a while to get off. I that. was a rock star. You guy. were addicted to having one of those. I drink rocks. Your habit was having an energy drink every day, every day before work. Is that work. Ben? 
Can yeah, you imagine me with a rock star right now? I would die. I would die. <laughs> I, I, I have half a cup of coffee and I have a panic attack. Like, what the hell is going on? I used to drink rock stars every day for work because I had to have energy to sell. And, like, one day I was just, like, walking to work and my heart went... Doo, 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 doo. And I was like, all right, that's it. I'm never drinking a rock star again. And I never had energy drink after that. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> yeah, Wayne me. used to do the five-hour energies. He used to do the stuff like that, you know. Like, I'm entering cardiac arrest because like I just stopped star. and looked at my heart and looked up. <laughs> he was doing that Went thing in the like, bathroom for like 45 show, minutes. Where you literally see an outline of a heart like beating yeah. out of a cartoon chest. <laughs> Pretty like, much exactly, all over. Like, it was like the, they were playing the drums in my heart. <laughs> And energy and, drinks are freaking expensive. And they're expensive. Yeah. They're like five bucks every time. But that was that was it for me. So, Black coffee. Yes, Ben, do it. Drink. Stop drinking energy drinks. There's a lot of bad stuff in there. You can find some natural ones out there or whatever. The Rock has a good one, apparently. But. Apparently. You know the Rock mean. says. The Rock has a great energy drink, guys. The Rock says it's great. Must be hey. great. He's all about being healthy, and he has one that's got like none of. The I mean, there's Lorana no way all, all of his realize. stuff is 100. Green tea. I'm, I'm just gonna be real here. It's made with He's green healthy. Tea. He's muscular, but there's no way that isn't some way partially enhanced along the years. You know what I realized is we talk about Dad liking Bieber. Dad talks about The Rock a lot. <laughs> Dad, you talk about the I rock never like look at lot. like Wayne's locker. Like if he had a little girl locker, a little locker in uh, <laughs> middle Bieber, school locker. The Rock, got Bieber, The Rock. <laughs> Who else does Wayne uh, talk about a bunch? Like you know those inspirational vlogger dudes dad type dudes oh, oh yeah yeah you yeah, yeah. don't like the rock i mean i like the rock Dwayne fine Johnson? he's a good guy I'm gonna... he seems fine he, he seems fine yeah he said something last year that pissed me off i can't remember what it is mm. now but it made me angry the rock i shake uh, my fist at you man you're shaking your fist at a rock yeah <laughs> um ramon i didn't realize i was doing this drink more water Oh, Ayo, drinking more water. Oh, Ayo. You can always... He said Oreos. He's like, yes. Oh, eat more Oreos. Oh, Ayo. Yeah, I just said that today. I need to drink three liters. I think it's a liter, right? Yeah. Three liters a day. Yeah. And I drink... What is this? A one liter? This thing we yep. drink? I drink one a day. So I, I try to drink, to drink a four a day. It's... Four a day? Yes. But honestly, like, you drink three of those a day, you feel the difference. You feel the difference, yes. You, you feel do. the dr- difference. The more water you drink, it is such a good habit. Drink water is free. Water is good, delish. Yeah. You will notice, though, the second you start drinking more water, if you get up from not even a liter or whatever to three liters, that so you're going to be peeing a lot more until your body gets used to drinking more water. You, one of my things was less coffee. And I, I don't know if it's because of the anxiety or whatever. If you get anxiety, that's a funny thing. Like, anxiety will let you stop anything. You'll just be like, I'm not doing it anymore because that wasn't fun. Yeah. You know what I mean? This is like mm, coffee. Was mine don't work that so like I that. Stop drinking it. Huh? I said my anxiety doesn't quite work like that, uh-huh. but I'm good. trying to also cut down coffee because twelve a literal whole pot of coffee is not good for anyone. I don't think it is. I think they said five cups is like the max decent, like where it yeah, stops. Sometimes I wake up and I'm benef- like, "Was that up?" And you're like, "No." <laughs> Where's, where's the coffee? <laughs> where's the coffee? In my belly. <laughs> In my uh, belly. Uh, <laughs> it's gone. It's so good. If no one else drinks it, then I literally will not stop drinking it. Um, Gabe said oh, becoming yeah. a space pirate. Have fun with that, Gabe. Wait, what did Gabe say? Becoming a space pirate. Gabe? Gabe, you never call. <laughs> you never reached out. <laughs> you never called. You never said Merry Christmas. I said Happy Hanukkah. I think did you he did. Merry Christmas. Oh, think. sorry. Never mind. <laughs> oh, Gabriel sorry Santiago about that. is now Gabriel Santinato. His name's lost. <laughs> name's not Santiago. Out of my mind. Don't dox Gabe. Nado. Nada. Yeah. Nada. Well, That's his name's right. literally on his Instagram. Actually, it's Snack Toes. Not Gabe. Um, no Snack Toes. <laughs> Gabe Schmabe. Gabe Schmabe. They were, he was really like, He's never going to listen to these podcasts, Gabe. That's how we knew you didn't love us. You didn't listen to the podcast. <laughs> Mom's about to Lame <laughs> Gabe. Mom's about to cry. <laughs> Only the real ones listen to the podcast. Pat Eric1990 says, Clean house. Ayo. 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 Ayo, Pat. If you're looking for a house to clean, I got a house for you, Pat. <laughs> yeah, bro. <laughs> Come over here, bro. No, there's nobody that can clean this house. 
Not that. There is. Not that. There kind are perfect. I know. There's not. It's not that dirty. We need though, to honestly. get rid of sixty percent of our stuff, and then we will have a clean house. I'm saving all this stuff until Cameron, until we leave the house, and then Cameron get rid of all the stuff. Yeah, is this your annoying. excuse? In my mind, I'm like, oh yeah, okay, I'm Cameron not gets going an through it because then Cameron can go through yeah. it. Will you tell her that? Yeah. I don't need any of this. We're going through stuff. What are we're you purging. Me? That's a habit we're going to do. We're going to purge. We're not going to buy anything oh that's God. not necessary. I need to purge so many clothes. Yep. Camden so has many. got to purge clothes that were in fashion oh, yeah. 10 years ago. Yeah. Because she's worn the same size. No, Justice. Cool. I have Justice clothes. <laughs> I have, I'm dead serious. Justice clothes. I had some pretty <laughs> Like, I recently toys. threw away that Galaxy cat dress that I had. That Galaxy <laughs> cat dress was adorable. And if it still fits yeah. you, you'd be wearing it. I guarantee it. Does it still? It didn't fit you. That one's third grade. You know, you need to have like a girls just want to have fun day and try on all your outfits. Cam hates trying on clothes. It's impossible. Cam hates trying on clothes. Camden will never be in a montage in a teen show where they're trying on clothes and looking happy. She's miserable. <laughs> she hates it. That's so funny. That's so funny. I always try to take her back to school shopping and like. Trying to get her to try on a bunch of stuff and pick out outfits and plan first day of school outfits. I will she's never like, be Cher. Sure. You just do it, Mom. I will never be Cher. Sure. Yeah, she's like, Mom, just do it for me. You've never been into that. Well, huh? here's the thing. I also, there's like a specific style. I, well, I realize. I, I wear a lot more. And it's, yeah. Anyways. It's not that fun to try on the same crop tops I know will like fit. Mm. Like, I but know you should style fit. them up a different way. Put them mm. with different jeans and a jacket and cute boots, or roll mm. your jeans up and try them with some jewelry, or put your hair different. You know, what I mean? do that. You you get mad at me when I try on clothes because you I put do clothes have away. fun montages in my room to my while well, watching like anime or whatever, and then you're like, Kim, what what happened to your because room? Because the clothes never get put away. That's an issue. Well, yeah. Okay, well, that's they like, don't show you that part of the two thousands movie montage. Yeah, putting away the clothes. That's right. No, they don't show you. They throw the, show them throwing it yeah. sometimes. <laughs> Where do you think it goes? On the floor, and then their mom yells at them. Yeah, I just I washed. Sure. I just washed this. <laughs> I am sure Horowitz or whatever. Bex, Bex. Oh my Bex. gosh, Bex missed you on Saturday. By the way, we did both Saturdays. Yeah, Bex. Bex! Yeah, Bex! <laughs> no, it's holidays, I understand. The she schedule around the holidays is crazy. Something I don't have, and that's a life. Wow. Yeah. Uh, so. Tough. She says, eating more fruits and veggies. Ayo! Yeah! I'm on it. Uh, yeah. On that's it. definitely more cool. fruits. But the fruits the have been, are being handled. We ordered fruit, and then it got canceled, so we had some fruits, but basically we've been living. Yeah. We got smoothie stuff, though. Bibi, so Bibi, how's it going, man? Bibi, all right, Bibi. Listen, man. Uh-oh. All right, so this is like listen 100%. to less. Podcast. Everything is me. Are you attack- attacking me? Less swearing. Yes. Less lottery. <gasps> healthier food choices, and less beers. <laughs> and Mary Jane. Oh, Bibi yeah. You have me tell Mary Jane, buddy. Wayne is definitely. Addicted to his edibles. What's Mary Jane? I went pot. Oh. What's that? You were very much reliant on your edibles. It's not smoking. Yeah. I haven't. I haven't actually done anything in like three days. Wayne I gave up. To. Wayne gave up beer quite a while ago. When Camden was born, he was always come home from work and have a beer. And it's been quite a few years since you've had beer. Yeah. Rolling Rock. Yeah, you were into a rolling rock. Quite a few. Hasn't it been more than quite like, a few? Like, I don't know how long it's been, but it's been a long time. But I haven't um, had a drink in a very, very, very long time. Which is which is pretty admirable. Like, uh, even like a glass of wine or champagne. Yeah, or no. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah. Which is good. Uh, I do kind of relate. We don't have lottery here in Vegas, but I do go to the casino weekly with my mom. And I just want to win badly, but I assume I, think, I could I be think, gambling Mom, more responsibly. I think that's not an unpopular opinion. No, I think I want to. I deserve it. <laughs> I think it. when people are like, <laughs> well, people go to the casino wanting to lose. <laughs> well, like no, guys, some people I might want be gluttons for punishment. Like you don't understand. I want. 
Hope I lose all my money today. It's, you know, like on The Bachelor when they say the person well, is deserving, have a deserving lot of-, of love. I am deserving <laughs> of money. Yeah, There's no one that. more. De- actually, my mom. There's no one more deserving to win at the casino than my mom. Yeah. She deserves it. Yeah. I am doing everything right. Why this, am I You're this casino owner. Yes. Rig it. Rig it now. She's deserving of money. Um, All good, BB. Good luck with those. That's a I'm lot a to take on at the same time. Oh, Yeetus Infant. Yeetus. Great name. Um, Yeetus this. <sighs> okay. Um, can you say it? Less porn? Less yeah. masturbation? No! Oh. Mother! I just said <laughs> what the... You, were, you seemed like you didn't want to say it out no, loud, no, so I was going to say it for you. I, it's because I'm just... I could never keep this. Turning stuff in on time. Turning oh Camden, good thing she's done with school. She's gonna start college up in the fall though. So at college, there's not they're not lenient. Oh, well, college is different. I'm gonna look at it. Yeah, college they're not lenient. They're not like I okay, you can turn this it. in for less credit or you can do yeah. it. It's like no, nope, it's a zero. I want to do it. You don't get fifty percent. I want to do college. Turning stuff in on time, admirable. Very admirable. Good luck. Um, I was never able to do it. In mm-hmm. how many years? 12 years? Cam- yeah, it was always Cam in school every year. Not have late assignments. I don't think I've ever, ever had a year that I actually just didn't miss anything. <laughs> I think this year I turned in everything there was, but very late. High school me is Stop. rolling over in her not grave because I'm alive, but like, you know what I mean? Goody, goody. I was a goody, goody. Goody, goody. Camden ain't no goody goody. Well, I'm a goody goody when it comes to most stuff. Just not. Not school. Not scholarly. She did great. A, B, on a roll. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Saying that, you make me feel like I'm in third grade. I (laughs) I feel like I need one of those little certificates. I had that once in like third grade. Where's my certificate? We used to always let Camden pick out like somewhere to eat or something, remember, for A, B, on a roll. Yeah. Yeah, the, that meal today was for you. I knew really? that it was based on your meal. Like, Thank you. That was something Camden went, so that was for you. That I'll was take your meal. it. <laughs> I'll take the meal dedication, <laughs> past main. Yep. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Could you taste the love? <laughs> um. Fod Herb says a uh, better sleeping cycle. So important. So like not not just so important up early, but also you should go to bed at a certain. It time. It is so important. I Everything you hours. read, if you lift weights or if you go to work or whatever you do, they say getting sleep is the most important thing you can do for just everything. Waking up earlier makes me go to bed earlier. Yeah, and working out and all and playing tennis and things like that, it makes you more tired. Mm-hmm. I don't have problems falling asleep. I'll tell you that much. I have a hard time going to bed at night. Hmm. I'm like better waking up in the morning now, but like going to bed at night is not easy for me. Like it's just like that's fun time. I play video game time. <laughs> is he even just laying? That in was bed my mindset here? in middle school. I'm like I don't want to go. Yeah, to sleep. Cameron was like, my mom's asleep. I must stay up all night and play video games yeah. because it's we fun. weren't like bedtime people. Why but... is it more fun though? I play video mm-hmm. games during the day too. It's more fun at night. I'm sorry. No, nah, sleepy, sleepy at night. <laughs> well, Mom, you go to bed at 8 p.m. No, I go to bed at like 10. Well, speaking of 7.45. <laughs> Just passes out during the podcast. <laughs> uh, 8 o'clock hits, guys. Like, oh, sorry, it's 8 o'clock, guys. We're going to wrap That's my this cue, up. guys. Uh, no, this has been my schedule at night. I watch <laughs> Wheel of Fortune Jeopardy with my parents. They come back. I shower and get ready for bed because I shower daily. That's one of my things. I do all my skincare, and I've been reading for about an hour. A night and then I go to bed so I'm on a schedule I'm on a routine folks oh you're the best dear says when you use a dish you rinse it off <gasps> immediately put it in the dishwasher when Cam's it's in. hey hold on I've been taking dishes out of my room immediately okay but they say rinse off the used dishes oh, yeah, put I it in an empty off. dishwasher uh, the dishwasher is not empty Wayne is dish man this man. He's a really good dish guy. I have to do it. It's I don't know what's uh, what the hell's wrong with me. Like, I cannot, if it's an OCD thing or whatever, because if I sit down and I start playing my game and in the corner of my eye I see the dishes are still there, I put my game down and I have to go do the dishes. I, I kind of, like, good to make sure that it, subscribe to the, if you cook, you don't have to do the dishes, so I enjoy the cooking, so Wayne does the dishes. Oh, so I have to start cooking then. No, please don't subject us to that. I can't do what you do. Time for me to learn how to do tofu dishes. Oh, that'd be so good, though. Imagine I can make good tofu dishes. You're a lot dishes. better in the kitchen than you give Imagine. yourself credit for. 
Oh, I know I'm good in the kitchen. <laughs> I know I'm a, I am a good cook. I am a great cook. Professing that you were a good cook before. You just liked fast food or what? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I have always said I'm just, a good cook. Yeah, Everything I make is amazing. <laughs> I always cook. What are you talking about? I mean, like, before, well, like, yourself. healthy stuff. And she's so, and I, you know, uh, what's that word? I'm so humble. I'm the most humble person you know. <laughs> <laughs> I'm good at everything. I'm amazing. <laughs> no, she As you, we were kid. like, guys, the worst thing happened. I was humbled by t- <laughs> learned I wasn't good at something. You need to be so humble about it. <laughs> Just play back. I am a good cook. I know I am. Play I can follow a recipe, go. though. That's the thing. I'm like following a recipe. I feel like it's just right. It's an instruction. You do exactly what it says. It. It's easy I peasy. I can't do it. You should do next fake Ikea meatballs Ooh. with the jelly stuff. Hmm. What is jelly stuff? You know, lingonberry ge- jam. Berry stuff that they put with the meatballs in. I keep. Oh, well, I thought you were saying jelly in the meat, and I was like, I'm gonna throw <laughs> no. out. No. No. Um. Bearded Kuma said, "Self confidence, yeah. Oh, yay! Self confidence. Self confidence. That's a good one. It would surprise you guys. Actually, no. I I'm fairly confident, but also I I hate doing everything and leaving the house. So <laughs> every time you're like, it would surprise you guys. Me, God above all, might be able to relate to this. <laughs> and they're like, actually, never mind. No." No, <laughs> no. The reason I'm not on camera is not related to self confidence. I was going to say that, but it's not. It's like anxiety. <laughs> it's about me. Like, I was gonna say I could relate to you feeble mortals under me, but <laughs> never mind. Never mind, guys. It's so annoying, <laughs> Wayne. It's funny. eighteen years of this, baby. What you think? What exactly? <laughs> I can't hear half the things you say. That's, that's why my, it works. That's, my that's thing. why we're together. Huh? Exactly. I tell you this right now. I tell you this. We're married 18 years tomorrow. That's right. Well, today. If you're listening to the podcast on Monday, it is today. Kim's 18 years. 18 years. That's how I know my I'm literally perfect. 18 years tomorrow. Yeah. And if you see this, you lose your hearing. Your marriage is better. Mm. Lose it. Mm-hmm. Lose your hearing. <laughs> it's not bad. What? I don't yell. Kim, don't yell. Sometimes. I yell for someone, <laughs> but I don't yell at someone. No, you don't yell at. Kind of sometimes. No, sometimes you're loud, though. I, I, I do kind of like, like, can I? Can I? Yeah. But it's not like angry. Yeah, it's more like that. Under the breath. <laughs> yeah, you know, exactly that. That's she not like an exaggeration. You go, <laughs> <laughs> growl. She she growls. <laughs> yeah. Under her breath. You, under the breath. You now. do. Yeah, that's how you know mom's yeah. mad. Growls. Mm. Are you coming in? Mm. Right there, I can't hear yep, it. There it is. That's right. <laughs> so, 18 years, baby. 18 years. We can do this. <laughs> we can do this. One more year. <laughs> 19? You gotta at least make it to 20. You're not gonna make it to a good number? Uh, I don't know. 18 <laughs> years, 18 more. 20. Then we I, call I it quits. Then we can it. call it quits. After 20. Alright. That's there right. You go, Tony. You gotta wait till your kids grown up and have a life of their own before yeah. you ruin their lives. <laughs> Big divorce thing. Cam needs to leave so I can leave. No, I'm just <laughs> <laughs> we just that's like such boomer humor. You're like my wife. Like I hate my wife. <laughs> I hate my wife. Look at the try I'm guys. like my husband's so lazy. <laughs> Look at that one try guy. Yeah, wife guy. I'm glad I don't have a wife guy. I can't because of the cats, and you know damn well you'd you'd get the cats in custody, and I just would kill me. So. That's right. There was a reason I'm why staying. I said um, we were going to have only the three old cats. We weren't going to get a new cat after that, but we got two more, so we're looped in for another twenty years. Damn it! <laughs> Hopefully, we're in a van by that. We time. have a good stick. You guys would be surprised, though. We love each other. This is our stick. We do love each other, and we 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 get along. Believe it. Or we not. get along pretty well. Yeah, she roasts me. But it's all in good time. Yeah. I, mean, I don't get offended. I'm unroastable, so... Unroastable. A <laughs> god among mortals. <laughs> exactly. I the worship myself religion. That's how I always said. <laughs> You're like, I'm so annoying. I'm actually god. Like, I'm... <laughs> <laughs> she's not narcissistic at all. I know. <laughs> no, no. Kind of. Maybe. I don't know. What does it mean? <laughs> what are you calling a narcissist? Don't, don't diagnose me. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, thinking straight. Uh, get that thing. I. It's so hard. 
thinking is thinking. freaking hard. Oh, yeah. I can't do that one. Uh, we've talked about it before. Wayne and I have talked about doing like brain games, doing more of those type of brain yeah, we exercises. Need to, like, actually take the brain it games does out of the help. <laughs> yeah. And play. Yeah, it. let's do brain Is games. That something. Babe. Excellent. I think it's a great idea. <laughs> like, I remember you bragging about that too. You were like, "We got Big Brain Academy." Yeah. You haven't played it. I got we're it in your stocking like it. two years ago, and my sister got it for me like two years ago. And we so have two copies. Yeah, we so we can play against thing. each other. Two years ago, and it's still nothing. Our played... brains, our brains are not big. Well, you need to go. To Wayne and I do Wordle, and that's about our brain for the day. I do like mini crosswords. Yeah, we but do I, I want to do more. Along with reading, I want some brain I want to read. And Dr. Mario, that works your brain. It does. When I was playing Dr. Mario every day with y'all, I swear, my, I was like. Okay, let's do it. So we can do that more. Well, you guys play Dr. Mario. Dr. Some Mario more? makes it think. All day I hear. <laughs> <laughs> I, it's so loud. You play it on the highest volume for some what? reason. What? It is loud. It is so loud. Even I know it's loud. Huh? It is so loud. Are you, you just it. that immersed? Da, 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 da. Yeah, I get it's like, like a, it's like zone. I'm part of like a championship going on. I get like a zone and I'm like super good at Dr. Mario. <laughs> like I'll I'm have like my door shelf headphones on. <laughs> <laughs> no, what's that good song? That's perfect. Is yeah. that good song? Da, 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 da. <laughs> da, da. I don't do 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 Oh do 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 What's that stupid ass sound I hear every five seconds when I'm dropping on me? I actually have no idea. Yeah. Something like that. That sounded like you can't do that on television. No, no. We have fever and chill. Which one are you talking about? Chill. Let's chill. Which one's chill? Wait, what? I can't do it. I hear it in my head, people. Are we going to get copyright? Oh, oh, yeah. Something like that. It's similar to oh, that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I kind of hear it. Hold yeah. yeah. See, I did good, Cam. Give me a cookie. <laughs> a cookie. Oh, yeah, I gotta make it. A... Hold on. I'm gonna... Will I get copyright strike if I... Possibly. Should... Sorry, uh, Nintendo. Like, two seconds? The 100 people will pay you royalties. Yeah? Yeah, for the 100 people who hear this song. Yeah, you guys gotta... I'm sorry. I'm out. Bum, bum. So it's all about Cam's habits. No, that's the other one. No, it's not. Keep going. <sighs> We're going to get copyright. Okay, well, we'll put chill on the story and you guys yeah, can see. And now we can monetize this episode. <laughs> we, don't mon- we don't make no money off you guys. Listen to it a million times. We'll make zero cents. No, we don't. We don't actually monetize. We make no money off you folks. We're not going to advertise something to you. Like Hello Fresh. Or Audible, or Honey app, or what are the other ones people advertise in podcasts? Don't buy those things. <laughs> yeah. Don't buy those things. And if you want oh, us to stop part. saying that, then you need to sponsor us. Yeah. <laughs> it was as good as mine. <laughs> no, yeah, because you made me remember it. Yeah. <laughs> so, brain games. Brain games. We're getting older. Anything Our brains are brain. getting more dull. They need to be sharpened. Especially you. <laughs> hey, you can't just point at me. <laughs> they not... could have thought I was talking about... Oh, I'm sorry, Camden. They could have thought I was talking about Camden. <laughs> We'd never. <laughs> We'd never. I'm you so sorry, my person. baby. I <laughs> would never. Okay. <laughs> See, this is our relationship. <laughs> Big old boomer joke. A big funny. old. I hate my joke. wife. My husband's dumb. My husband's <laughs> stupid. <laughs> Do you have any more Camden of habits people want to pick I up? I didn't hear anything you guys said for the last forty five exactly. minutes. Exactly. So. Oh. <laughs> One of the habits I want to have is turn off my phone sooner before bed. You know what I mean? Like they say, turn off your phone an hour before you intend to sleep. Like don't look at it. Mm-hmm. Because I use my phone, like, until I intend to fall asleep. Yeah. It's, so, it's easy no electronics. Like... And I also, I've said this before, I'm like a child. I need the TV to fall asleep. I want to break that is habit this year. Is that bad for you? Why? You know what I You don't do? get as good of sleep. This is going to sound really This is not good for me. you, I don't think. You know what I want to do? Sleep. I want to go off the grid for a little bit. I'm sorry, you're Ooh. what? You can't do that. You Wayne... will be unemployed, like, double. 
Only, can you schedule you double? Can you, you, you go off the grid for double like unemployed? Three days. <laughs> double I mean? unemployed. No job. No <laughs> no fake job. <laughs> no job. No side hustle. No job, our, no our, side po- our post will be taken care of. Oh, you the the schedule post. Everything will still be happening. You're gonna hire oh. someone. They yeah. have apps for that. Oh, let's you go off grid. I mean? Cam and I were talking. We were looking at the mountains when we were doing something. I'm not going when off we grid driving. unless I'm literally off grid. No video That's games. what I'm saying. So, like, no, we were no looking at the mountains home. and we were thinking about Nature. camping or doing something. Yeah. So you're going on the hike with us, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Or oh. we can just go camping and be off grid for, you know, a weekend. Yeah, camping off yeah, the grid. let's do that. Uh, I want to do... I want to do... But, like, one of those one-day hikes. No, yeah, 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 yeah. What I want to do... Two-day ones or whatever. Scary ones. We're planning, like, three months, and you it's think... Scary. It is scary. But, but like, I, I think... I'm clothed and afraid. <laughs> yes. I'm afraid of you I want to do at least, like, a one-night hike one day. Yeah, let's do it. Sounds great to no, me. But it sounds like a... Do you, couldn't you do that? Like... Less electronics, less whatever it is. That Devices. I don't want to be the person like everyone's on their phone because Our... everyone is on their phone. That's what everyone's life is on your phone. You check your bank on your phone. People you check your tweet, email on your everyone's phone. Everyone's on their phone from their freaking phone. You kind of buy your food, on grocery stores on the phone. You listen no to podcasts. Electronics. But like just on an electronic putting them away before bed show. and then reading my book when I go to sleep. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's a good habit. Yeah. Off the grid. What book are you going to give me? I, I you will give finish. you a book to you me. What finish. book? Off the grid by myself. Oh. oh. Ah, there's the rub. Can't, you guys we'll drop you off. Over there, we'll drop off you off. We'll drop you off. over here. Off the grid somewhere. And then I'll be using my panic button to call you. You can help me get back on the grid. Because <laughs> I'm out in the middle of Yeah, you don't Blair go Witch totally off grid. You always have to have some sort of in reach or some sort of well, yeah, GPS device have, so yeah. someone can find you if something goes bad. I'd have to bad. finally use that SOS on my iPhone and yeah. see what happens. I'm too scared. I hate that thing. Have you ever accidentally pushed that button and it's oh, like, call SOS? Have... No, and it goes, <gasps> Oh my yeah, god, no! It, it's not gonna hurt, do anything. That's what it does. As when long it starts as you, like, counting hang up down. Quickly. No, it has a 10 second. I've done this before. Oh, <gasps> 10 Camden. No, I've never actually called the police. <laughs> oh my god. There's it's a not 10 the police, second. It's like the National Freaking Guard. It, no, it's not. It's the, the police, National Guard. I don't want no <laughs> people who signed up for National Guard to know in the desert. It's not the National because Guard. I know the Coast people Guard. who have. The Coast Guard boats I know people up to our house. It, and it's like, oh, my phone died. It's like nine one one. What's your emergency? And they're like, sorry, I called. Sorry, it's an iPhone. I bet the police hate iPhones, man. I mean, because how many times you get a call and you're like, nine one one. What's your emergency? They're like, sorry, man, I got an iPhone. You know damn well somebody's hit it and then they answer and they're just like, I just want to know what it does. I'm sorry. <sighs> yeah, that too, probably. And they're like, okay, well, you know, I mean, like, that's not the one they're gonna do. You know, well, they're probably annoyed. I called the sheriff once when I was like nine. I don't know. I was nine. I was nine. I was like thirteen sheriff. years old. I grew up. Dad in, called the sheriff one day. Texas. I called the sheriff. It was the cops, but the sheriff showed up because we lived outside the city limits, and they were like, "Did your son call the police?" And I was like, "I just wanted to know." Oh my God, Wayne, you're so bad. What would happen? I just want to know what like be like. Nine one one though no, it was happens? an actual like phone number. What happens if you and do then that what, you just requested them to come visit? I don't remember why the hell I did it. Like, I was hey, you want to come over for some? <laughs> yeah, I'm lonely. <laughs> I wanted to see how long it my took. My mom's. I want to see how long it took. You know, like we die if there were murders in our house or you know oh, fire. It was research. And the sheriff, I was like, yeah, we would have been dead. It took an hour. Oh, one hour. Yeah, you would have been dead. So. No. Jeez. Defend ourselves. What's I guess. the point of having a sheriff? If, huh. First of all, when the sheriff comes and not the police, you already know right there you're screwed. Yeah, the sheriff. You're I done. mean, you're pretty guy much screwed. Like no matter old, what. You know what I mean? I mean, you're pretty. The 80 year old guy can barely walk. It's like somebody yeah. called the police. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god this year is gonna be our year guys it's gonna be our year it's freaking gonna be our year or i'm gonna, gonna get angry it's gonna be our year alice is getting angry oh angry if it's not my year i'm really freaking health wise gonna get angry mental yeah. wise and all everything that wise everything that's going on in our life it's gonna get better it has to get better we have to do stuff we have the steps to make it it's our already year. getting we better just make it our year yeah. laying in bed it's it already getting better way. I wish yeah. it did. I wish it did. I wish it did too. It Anyone not. who's struggling, struggle through the holidays or whatever else, we hear you. Not everything is good. It's not always going to be good, but we can try to make it better. Donna tennis. We're doing. And I've been drinking a lot of water. Water, water, bros. Drink I've had your water. like one Honestly, or two Pepsi's. It's about the easiest thing I've, you can oh do. Oh my is god! Drink water. 
I went from like eight Pepsis a day to like one or two. I we have guess. been spending much less money on, on on Pepsi. You better drink more water. I saw you fill up your water yesterday. Class. High five. Thank clap. you. And, yeah, high five. And, and and work on my brain. Oh, high bigger five. brain for me. High five. Ha! There. She high fived me. Well, you're He's like across the room. Across freaking room. So enjoy your <laughs> high five. I'm not getting up. I'm not. Getting I don't think I'll be this. able to do this off the grid hike after all, because I can't go halfway across the bed <laughs> to high five Camden. No, Wayne is so <laughs> lucky. Wayne's tall. You guys know Wayne's tall. He's like six one or whatever. So tennis is just like oh, so easy that. for Wayne. It sucks for Wayne. Wayne can and take one step and he can do the thing, or form. he can like um, do a serve without having any proper form, and it like goes in. It's not fair. That's like behind his head. Those yeah, it's spin. like terrible people, form. Like, I have exactly like I don't need proper form. It's I have, tall like, people have technique that you don't. No, know but if you had tall you know, man technique tall, and form, tall. yeah, if you had form, you'd be good. You'd be better than me because you're tall. Uh, why, what? what? So get good, bro. Get good, man. That is a myth. People thought that I was tall and be good at basketball. I was not good at basketball. You have an advantage, though, uh, where it takes me like that does not mean two that or three steps to get to the ball. You can take one step and get to the ball, and you'll be able to get a lot more leverage. You know what I mean? Uh, so you have an advantage. I think uh, maybe they need that for defense in basketball. Like put your hand up, stop the ball. Is that what it is? Mm-hmm. Six one's not even that tall for basketball. There's people that are like eight feet in basketball. I'm sorry, one. I don't know. I don't, know. I don't know. Is there an eight foot basketball player? Someone will have to tell me. I don't think so. Maybe seven. Eight okay. foot. And yeah. that is not even a yeah, world man, record. Like seven six or something. He's way know. taller than Shaquille O'Neal standing next to each other. I don't know. Jesus, Louise is. I never want to meet these people. Kim, I don't like Kim. Scared I tall people. I got megalophobia, bro. I would have panic attacks. It tag. is so handy having a tall person around the house, though. This is why we've made it eighteen years. <laughs> I can't. I cannot. Dad it's can't so, hear you. I know. And not then, listening, but man, I'm just giving you life life hack. If you're five two, you got to marry someone tall. That would be good for like boxing too because i can like reach mm-hmm. he's mm-hmm. seven six i was exactly right seven six okay uh, that's not eight feet that's seven and a half that's four inches away from four whatever is no, away six from inches eight. six inches huh there's 12 inches in a foot <laughs> <laughs> brain big brain time baby like we talked about before oh sun ming ming is seven nine uh, well, brain. We're gonna work on the brain. Yeah, that's All right. right. So I know what the difference between feet and inches. How many inches are in a foot? This We're is kindergarten, baby. I know that one. We did it, guys. We did another podcast. That's a good habit, Woo-hoo! I guess. That's pretty good. Woohoo! Oh yeah, that's another one. Every week a podcast. No, that's I'm not right. even gonna lie. We I got thought our podcast it. was dead. Like when we didn't do it for how long? Three months or something. Six months? How long did you we thought it was do over? it? No, it's six months. Three months? It was a really Three long months? Time. How long were we gone? Three I months? I don't remember, but it was a while. We before. don't talk about the I dark think, like, time. Yeah, we three don't months. talk about the past. And, uh... Yeah, was. I thought we were done. Yeah, Cam is Not like, if I lie. don't bring it up, they'll never make me do it again. <laughs> I enjoyed the podcast. No, Cam's such a trooper. December 19th, December 12th, December 5th, November 28th. November 27th, did, June 23rd. June, July, August, September, so June October. To November. Five months. June. Wow, we really did drop the ball, guys. Yeah, Damn. and that's why everybody was threatening to leave. <gasps> they were going to leave us. <gasps> exactly. No. Yeah. We're going to lose. Remember what Ben said. Our no, family. I don't get it. I'm leaving. They were going to leave us. <laughs> We're back though. So now after the holiday, a little bit of break, but we've been doing it pretty consistently. We're, we're not. Back, we're not bad. We're back. Maybe not better than ever. Maybe not even as good as our worst. <laughs> but we're here. We're and here, we're guys. Trying, we're and we're trying, and that's all we ask time. of you. We're doing the best we can. Really, it is. It's the best we can. Oh, yeah, is it though? So Maybe it's, it might be closish. It, it's. Better than worse. Better than just like. Better than. I guarantee we're not the worst podcast in the world because everyone has a podcast. Come on, they're. Out. I'm sorry, but they're some podcasts. Podcast. Yeah. Podcast those alpha are male like podcasts. Are those are yeah. the worst ones. How'd that go? Guess. Podcasts are like babies. Everyone can have one, but not everyone should. That's pretty true. Those alpha males. Yeah. I yeah. hate men. Cam hates Cam hates podcasts in general. She won't even listen to our podcast. You don't listen to our podcast, but yeah, you don't like listen to Andrew any Tate other podcast. There's no other, like, cool anime podcast out there or nothing? Bro, I don't care. Why would I listen? 
Why? I don't get that. I don't get why people listen to podcasts on movies or shows or... If it's about Camden doing movies, her Bachelor she's podcast, like, she's like, why would anyone listen if to it's no, about, I like, don't 80s get it. horror I'm movies, you, I might listen to it. Because I remember when you were like, we should make a podcast, I'm like, I hate podcasts. I'll do it. I'm not listening to it. <laughs> I, like, prefer podcasts than watching a live stream. But why would... Specifically, I plan on starting a side podcast. Specifically, okay. You've said this before. I Retro hope you do do it this year. Yeah, once my hearing's perfect. Because it's going to be pointless if I can't do it the week yeah. after. You know what I mean? But it's we already got the first episode on YouTube with Choppy Ma. But that's just voiceover. Okay. No, but well, we are doing the going. world a favor like. by having a Bachelor's podcast. Okay, you guys did not have to watch Bachelor in Paradise. Yeah, you can watch. Jesus you can me. listen if you are fans of The Bachelor, which is coming back later this month. Like, yeah. we're doing God's you can work do here. our ba- Bachelor I mean, podcast. There are, like, 50 other recap. Ours is least, better. Our Bachelor yes, podcast is better. It is. And it's more critical, <laughs> in a way. And it it's is. it's more... Here's in-depth. the thing. We're not sponsored by Bachelor Nation. No. Nor are we suck-ups. Yeah, we don't suck up. Therefore, you will get real content. That's right. And us saying people are annoying. That's right. And Bachelor Nation's annoying. And yeah. why do we watch this show? Yeah. While we're, while why do we we're watch this show? Oh my god, we have to watch Okay, Wayne's asking something. <laughs> you <laughs> understand this joke that I just posted on Instagram that's 50-50 for people. Is this a joke you made up? Jerry is filling his car up in the woods. Jerry Cameron is says, filling. why? says, because Jerry can. Oh, Jerry can is like that thing. Yes. Gas can. The Jerry can. In it's like the olden word, days. Gas can. People say Jerry can still. Whoever but like the, the, the better question is who uses a jerry can? Unless no you're one. like on the side of the road and you have one in your trunk, which is I don't know who does that, but there exactly. are people that do that. There are. They fill them up for their lawnmowers or whatever and else. They go to the gas station, they fill it yeah. up. I've never in my life, never ever, ever, ever in my life, filled up my car with a jerry can Me or a either. gas can. I've never filled one up either. Ever. No. I know that's like for uh, if you're like in the middle of nowhere and you got to go get one, you buy one. At the, oh, you know what? I have. Once. I didn't do it, but I bought it at the gas station on one of our trips, I remember. Hmm. And they're, like, at the gas station, and you buy them. And then, I don't remember what huh. happened after that, but I did buy one. Wow. Well, wow. Anyway, yeah, you know what Jerry can is. Half the people got it, and half the people didn't. Yeah. yeah. It's divided. Kind of like most your jokes. So, I'm thinking that, like, old people know what Jerry can is, yeah. and people don't. I you mean, you your hair is so interesting right now, by the way. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> Who's I'm that? having a hard time looking You're at you. You're my barber. Okay, a little better. That's better, babe. You're my barber. We should get that. I'm like we your hostage barber. That. I don't want to do it. Don't make me do it. We should take care of that. <laughs> That's what I want for my anniversary. Okay. Short hair. Hmm. I'll Cost do it. I'll do it. I, time. I'll do it. Okay, guys. Thank you so much for listening to our podcast. Please share it with thank other people you who you think might like our family content. We're wholesome, right? Um, sometimes. I guarantee you we like each other better than oh, most no, family in internet people. In that way, people. we're wholesome. We're not exactly family-friendly wholesome. What? We're the most family-friendly people I know. Why wouldn't we be? I hate everyone. I think we talk about balls a little more than... Balls! We should be using the actual word word and say testicles. (laughs) Is that what the issue is? Testicles. If you think people would listen to us, you don't know why they would. But if you do, (laughs) share this podcast, please. No, when Dad talks about... And let them know. Famous-ish, you can Google it. And we actually have a panel. It's crazy. Wow. You know what else we have? I just figured this out. We have a hate cam panel. When you hit, when you when you go, hey Cam, guess what comes up? Google guess what comes up entirely when you Google, hey, too much. Comedy show. Yes, he. I've as never googled myself. I've never Comedy googled series. you. I've I'm never sorry. googled Comedy Camden. Series. I've googled it because it's funny and actually really kind of scary. I'm just curious if like it's Google. Scary. This is how it works. You you do something right in social media, and the more you do it, the more Google notices you. That's the whole point. I gotta Google myself. That's how you get bigger. Google That's me. how you make it a living. I gotta Google myself every I'm month not doing to make it because sure I'm, I'm not uh, on wiki feet. Can't hide your feet. We we got these feet locked up, bro. Yeah. I'm not doing it because I got I'm my obsessed money making with myself. Dude, I can't let my... me one day without telling me, and I didn't have socks on, and I went, don't post that. <laughs> He doesn't understand. He doesn't Don't, understand. No free merchandise. No free feet pics. Yeah, I guess you use dinosaur joke yet. Stupid feet. 
Yeah. I'm going to zoom in on your no, face. No, just put a little thingy. Put a no, box. No, I have permission to zoom in Put on a box it, on it. So them. they don't get the free Why are you against zooming in every... No, they'll they'll find a way. They'll save it. They'll crop it. They'll find yeah, like a thing that'll be way. like. Or was it a Christmas joke? Life uh, finds a way. Why not be able okay. to use it now anyway? We're so annoying. Bye, guys. Thanks <laughs> for listening. Bye. 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 <laughs>